a team-based strategy game in which players struggle with intelligent machines, competitive cooperations and time, deal with invention of new technologies and the construction of huge working units that allow you to counter the scale of the threat. Ciao a tutti Marcello and welcome to a new first look video. Today we take a look at Precursor's Emerald Angels by Artificial Worlds. This is a turn based strategy game where we guide giant mechs. We must build and develop, research new weapons. All of this to um, counter an alien threat. Some info about the game. This is a single player PC game available on Steam. Released on the 27th of December 2021. You will find the link inside the description. We will take a first look at the game, we will see the user interface and how things work in a game. Anyway, let's go! Let's start a new game on normal. Maybe I want to skip the intro and leave it to you. Here we are. This is the, the starting up, the starting screen. We can manage things. We got 120 days left until the menace arrive. Five engineers, five scientists. We got missions, but now we got some warnings about the academy. Let's go. Each mech torso contains a reactor destroying the reactor, and the mech torso will the cause an explosion. The core of each unit. Our unit's weapons are always trying to penetrate the reactor. Destroying a reactor destroys a unit. Okay. Uh, it will cause an explosion on units, weapons always try to hit the opponent's torso. To do this you need to adjust the distance of the weapons and the position of the shot to effectively shoot at the torso. We got some tutorials and you need it because there's a lot of button to it. Tactics, some acts do better with others in different circumstances. Each weapon and its assembly on a given mech has advantages and disadvantages. Each mech has a unique distance and position at which it is most effective. Mechs from the Messiah family and several models later invented have an M MP as the strike that paralyzes the enemy's aiming abilities. It is a good idea to use this ability as often as possible against the most dangerous enemies. Pilots. <clears throat> Crandor, Craig, Beaky, Dawn, Glance and Sparkle. What is this? Sparkle, Weapons and Materials Engineering, Role Engineer, click to change Pilot's Ability. Let's go back to Come Tutorial. To our... Okay, I don't need this. Let's go back. Then we got the Research tab. Let's see what we can do. Tactical Lasers, Reinforced Hull, Improved Missile Lancer. Um, let's go for a simple one, the tactical laser. Improved tactical laser will allow us to gain an advantage in electromagnetic weapons. The works will... the works will. Grey Fox R2. Five days left. Okay, we have five days left for the research to be done. Then we got the build. Select the Mac, Grey Fox, Messia, Federation Light Tank, and Recon Rad. Infrared la Laser. Let's go back. Then we got the units. Here we can manage our Mac Pilot. Render Craig. Click here to change. What I can change here? Sparkle. Pilot's abilities. Uh, 
dawn. You know, something. Click here to change. Render Craig. Camouflage. What is this? Let's go back. Then we got the academy. What we can do here. Ah, oh, okay. Here is the academy. Missions. Hello Commander, it's time to learn how to command our machines. We'll start with a simple training mission. The target are two unarmored and lightly armored robots. Okay, let's have a look. We will spend five days. The departure. Athena is training mission. Let's skip. Targeting increases the accuracy of the unit to maximum outstanding. Keep it high. Okay. Communication increases the accuracy level of three other random units. Cost three action point. Okay, here we are. We can move. We can go. This is Grey Fox A1. This is our hull. I think this is a sort of... Okay, energy, the stored energy to activate the shield's defense model. If one is mounted on the mech, okay. Hit. Mech hit level. Overrating the mech can cause weapon system to explode and even the explosion of the reactor itself. This is the... Uh, the targeting increases the level of the max targeting sensors. The normal value is slightly above 50 of a of certain hit, while with outstanding it is almost 100. The better the value, the smaller the deflection of the shirt in case of a miss. Okay. Then we got this rounds. The number of rounds that are ready to fire. Okay. And this one. Is missile mi missiles the number of missiles ready to fire? Okay, then we got this four tab with icons actions the number of remaining actions of the active mech. Clicking here will automatically return to the active mech. Okay, we got this one the gray fox. We control this one. Then there is the enter, okay. Select the next possible target. This one I think will skip. Cool down, uh, cools the active mech, causing it to use one one action for this purpose. Okay, cool down. Um, this will reduce the heat. Okay. Um, then we got targeting, increases the level of the mech's targeting sensor. Okay, and then we got communication increases accuracy by one to three random max. Okay, then we got the, the abilities, I think. Weapons status, the status of my combat system. Uh, D means damage. Okay, R is the range. A is the level of armor remaining on the weapon. Okay. Infrared laser, infrared laser, stingray. Okay. Um, let me take a look at this range. By holding this button pressed, you will see the estimated range of this type of mounted weapons. Okay. If I. Nice. By holding it, you can see the the range. We can reach the enemy, I think. Then we got this range well oh this one is is range okay this is the range of this other weapon um i think that we must move okay wow animation looks cool 
now it's Messia turn. Oh, I think we can... We can attack them. MP Strike. Disrupt the enemy's aiming sensor. Make it difficult for him to make a good shot in the next round. Attack with the secondary weapon. Alpha Strike. Immediate strike with all weapons. It only takes one action but generates extra heat above the norm. Okay, let's see how the heat grows up. Target acquired. Let's focus on one enemy. Let's try the sequential. Sequential style allow you to attack with all weapon system without excess heat, but it's lower than Alpha Strike, taking two actions and giving the opponent a better chance to block with the shield. While with this one, let's try the MP aiming sensor. Torso damage about four. Four damage and let's move. Let's pop some tanks. Let's move focused. Um missile strike. Let's try the missile strike. Orders received. Wow. We destroy it. Target locked. Now we can attack. Let's see. The sequential or even this one. We got outstanding. I think outstanding. Outstanding. This is the all. Let's try this. We completely missed the target, but we can still try. Another one, we got three action. Another one, we are giving all we have. Let's keep trying. Destroyed. Famously, the training robots didn't even scratch you. Zero days left. Let's see the research. Improved tactical laser will allow us to gain an advantage in electromagnetic weapons. The works will gray for Fox A2. We can go on another on another research. The reinforced all. Build, select a mech. Messiah. It cost 265. I don't know why I want to build. I don't know if I need to build something. Maybe I have to. Let's try with the Messiah. This is a long range unit. Wow. Look at the design. Let's see all of the four, four of them. Select. This is the Federation light tank. Then there's the Reckon Rat. Okay. And the Grey Fox. Short range strike you when you get closer to your opponent and fire whatever you have on board. Let's build the first one. I like the Messia. Messia mech construction. Construction started. It takes 15, 50 days, 15 days to be to be done. Research unit academy missions. Our information have reported to us about the competition that is preparing the construction of a base in Athena. It's quite a light brigade. You should handle them. 
It is possible to take over Federation resources on Achilles if you get rid of enemy units. We got um, different missions to choose from, with different rewards and different times to be done. Let's try one of them. Cooldown costs one action point allows the unit to cool down. Overeating the mech exposes it to additional damage and burn out of weapon system. Our range we can we can reach them. So we can start firing all the things we have. We must be careful to to our hitting senses. A roller launcher. Let's keep focusing on this one. Okay, we are un unstable. Unstable. Okay, we bring it to normal. Now we can try to attack, maybe. Now it's focused. I think you must always do this before an attack. Nice. This is normal, let's focus a little for a price size attack. And then let's try. Look at the heat of the enemy that is growing up. But we must check our also. Okay, now we got a princess attack. Let's keep focusing on this one. Target acquired. Not a great deal of damage. Coming again, increase the scores we have a tree random mech. Let's give some precision to all our mechs. This one has an outstanding hitting chance. It's doing a lot of damage to our unit. This is a grey fox and I think this one is the... This one is the light... The light unit. We must... We must try. Stay a little... Near the enemy. Oh, look at our, our, our heat. We must. And the turn to activate the mech. Uh, the cooldown, which one was? Select the next one. I think this one will do the trick. Okay, we got a mail list for the cool, for the...
Nice. Went down. Let's move. Like lightning in the clouds. I think I cannot attack anymore. So the only thing I can do now is helping the Adamax with the aiming. Skip the turn and improve. Finally. Bravo, great job. I think they will remember this lesson for a long time. We got some resources. Still things to buy, build up. Okay guys, let me know what you think about the game in the comments below. Remember to hit the like button, share the video, subscribe to the channel and also consider supporting us through all our pages and please visit teambaselovers.com. Wish you the best. Ciao!